Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. So I am going to take you guys to my favorite Dollar Tree locations today. It's been a few days, or maybe like a week since I've been to Dollar Tree. I've just been kind of at home, filming at home, doing stuff around here, getting stuff done. And I really didn't have time to go to Dollar Tree, but today is the day we are going. And these are like my two favorites because one of them is one of the largest Dollar Tree locations where I live. And that says a lot because where I live, we have like 40 Dollar Trees. No joke. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. That's like one of the reasons why I like where I live. <laughs> one of the benefits, one of the few benefits to where I live is the amount of Dollar Trees we have. They're pretty bomb. Come with me and see what we can find today. I'm really hoping for some good makeup jackpots and I'm excited about it. So let's go. At my first store, I found these really cute signs. This one said, drink coffee, cuddle cat, stretch, repeat. I thought that was adorable. This one was really pretty. It had a perfume bottle and says, she has faith. I loved this one. It would be really cute in a beauty room. This one just had some pretty like succulents and flowers. And then this was like one of those super cute chalkboards you could use if you have a kid and you can put their height and stuff and their age and their name. I also found these giant sphere ice molds. I think these are actually for like alcoholic beverages but if you have a cup that's big enough you can put it in like a water cup so those were cool you could also do um, those chocolate bombs I found some Father's Day stuff this is at my favorite Dollar Tree location these are little like coin banks that you can give to your dad I don't know I thought they were kind of cute I don't know if any dads collect coins I love these little signs this one says dad's workshop my tools my rules um, I also found this one that says dad's fishing rules. So those are fun and these cute little picture frames. You could put a picture in of you and your dad. And then they had these really fun men's toiletry bags in a couple different prints that I think would be perfect. I actually picked one of these up for a gift for my dad. So there's a couple patterns to choose from. And I feel like a lot of men don't have like a toiletry bag. So and they were also like really nice material, like pretty well made, I would say. In the 4th of July section, they had this really fun pen, and this reminds me of like something I had when I was little, so that was cute. They had tons of different flags. They had this one, which I thought was cute because you could actually put it on your car. I love these signs. I'm not sure if I showed these to you guys before, but this would be cute for your door. And there was a lot of new craft stuff. This is a dry cloth, and it shows that they have like tie-dye. Lots of new little craft kits, so pom-poms, a uh, faux stained glass kit. I had never seen any of these before. This was really cute. It was like a recyclable craft. This is um, a little button bag craft kit. And then this is a new mixing tool set. They had like redone the whole craft aisle and upgraded it. And they had so much more wood craft items. You could DIY this little wood crafting kit with little scoring tools. And then tons of galvanized metal stuff. I honestly felt like I was in Michael's because the they had so much stuff. These new metal tags, um, galvanized clouds, and tons of just like little pieces that you could create stuff with. Flowers, they had signs. I was really surprised at how much stuff they had. It was really nice actually. And then I think I showed these also to you guys previously, but they have the galvanized letters as well as the numbers. And then they had all these nice wood signs. This whole section, like I said, had all this new stuff. I loved the heart one. So check out your crafter square section. This was like my favorite one that I'd ever seen. I just wanted to give you guys an overview. This is another one of those signs, but you guys, isn't this so weird? So like this would be if the baby was born, you put the height and the weight, but then the bottom says, can't wait to meet you. And I just thought it was funny because at that point you had probably already met them, <laughs> but I thought it was still cute. And then they had these little uh, thingies. I don't know what you would call them. There's a name for them, like geodes. I think that's the name in different colors. And they're just fun. If you like this kind of style, they had some different colors. So those were unique. They have a lot of new magnets. I loved these because they were unique in the fact that they were like thicker and kind of had this like canvas 
fabric and I loved that one that said grateful this one said laugh it's free aspire to inspire so I like those I really like these two these pet mats you could put your cat or dog or whoever's bowls on it and they were actually like really sturdy and like a nice thick plastic and I had never seen those this was so cool they had these adorable baby onesies and these were actually name brand so these polka dot ones were super cute and they had this like plain red one and i'm actually going to show you guys this is from a brand called briscoe baby but the clothing is actually american apparel so these were so cool to find this is um just a couple other styles they had this like little gray onesie with snaps they had different kinds with like stripes on the sleeve like a little baseball shirt and they also had a blue color as well this would be great too if you like to diy with your silhouette or cricket you could like customize these and put whatever phrases for a baby shower the infamous <laughs> gold baskets i also love these acrylic containers i have a bunch of them in my fridge and in my freezer and they're just so handy for organizing this was a name brand find, this trifold pill storage box. So there was like four different compartments. Um, you could also use it for jewelry, earplugs, um, rings, really anything. So that was a cool find if you like to organize. In the hair section, I found this new name brand, Sincerely Jewels. She's a blogger and scoonchy. uh hair scrunchies. And I thought these were so cute. They were like a soft velour material. And these little hair clips, they also had this one, and then they had them in gold as well. Another Sincerely Jewels find. I may have shown this to you guys previously, but it's like this cute little embroidered headband, and her stuff is so well made. This is a name brand as well, Tag Sport Body Wash. And I believe this brand is discontinued, but I just wanted to show you guys like um, I turn it around so I can show you like that it's a name brand. It's not like a Dollar Tree brand. Um, so they had a bunch of different scents to choose from. And then this was such a cool find, Power Stick. Um, you guys may have seen them previously at the store. They actually have these aluminum-free deodorants now at Dollar Tree. And they have three different scents. So they have Lavender Vanilla, which I did pick up, Cucumber Mint, if you like more of like a <laughs> cucumber scent and they also had peony coconut so that was exciting i found these new name brand post workout face and body wipes this would be really nice to throw into your gym bag you get 30 wipes in there this is another one this was the active one with lemon and sage and this is actually made by global beauty care these are aloe cooling face and body wipes also great for Father's Day. And then I finally found the Ioni Single Lashes. These are wispy medium full. So there are uh, two other kinds, which I'll show you guys in a later video. But um, these are cool, especially for like makeup artists or if you're doing like brides or bridesmaids. I really like the individual ones. And then I found these Hard Candy Glitterazzi Eye Glitters. They were a little dried up. The shade was galactic. A little dried up, you can see. This was the white shade, and I did a close-up so you can see it better. I also found the Wet n Wild Glitter Shadows. I've been finding these at every store. I love this shade, Cashmere, Cashmere Love. Very similar to like a Stila Glitter and Glow. This one was really fun because it had like a purple reflex. And then this was the Liquid Cat Suit. Um... It's like a metallic and then this one was from their limited edition mermaid collection and then this was like a really pretty uh green eye glitter this is the wet n wild loose pigment this was from when they launched that unicorn dreams collection there was like a couple colors of these this is unicorn dreams i've also found that previously these really cool and colorful acrylic nails i love these and they had so many new styles. They had these like matte shapes. So if you like doing your nails or if you wear press-ons, they have literally the cutest ones. I don't wear press-ons because they bother me <laughs> personally, but they're so cute. I also found these Maybelline Vivid Matte Liquid Lipsticks. You guys, how cool is this? I found um, all these shades, Vivid Violet, Pink Charge, and then I found these more like funkier shades and they had so many of these. So I was really excited about that name brand fine. And then they just had them in these little like fish bowls. 
more colored nails. These are like a pastel colors. You can mix and match. Hard Candy Shine All Day Translucent Finishing Powder. I am excited to try this because I am oily. And it supposedly is a dupe for a NARS pressed powder. So we'll see how it is. I They also launched this new cuticle remover, the Dollar Tree Sassy and Chic brand. I wish it didn't have the um, blue and parabens in it. But I do love using cuticle remover. I loved these mugs. They reminded me of like Hobby Lobby. Super cute. And this one was so cute. Pets turn a house into a home. Okay, this was a crazy find. I found all these name brand iPhone cases. Um, if you have an iPhone 7, 8, or X, then it's your lucky day because they had so many designs, so many prints. Um, and then this was a really cool one. It was a heat sensitive case. So when you like press your finger against it or if it was in the sun, it will change colors. How cool is that? And this brand I'd never heard of, but everything looked like really nice quality. This one was so cute with the gold flakes. And I was like so shocked that I found these because they just looked so, so nice. This is not my first time finding name brand phone cases at Dollar Tree. Um, they have lots of different solid colors. I guess because this phone is not as popular anymore because they launched that newer phone that has like the three cameras. So they're probably trying to find a way to get rid of these. So cute with the glitter on it. And then this is just like an orange one. Okay, moving on. More makeup finds. The Glitterod C Press and Play from Hard Candy. This is the one where you press your lips together and it makes like a glitter, like the Ciate Glitter Flip. Um, I also found the Milani Stellar Lights Holographic Gloss. You may have seen this in my last tutorial. This is the time when I actually found these in the store. And <laughs> running out of breath, this is in the shade Kaleidoscope. It's like a fun duochrome, like purple kind of shade. So I'm super psyched about all the Milani finds. And then, of course, the Flush by Revlon Foundation Stick. I used this in my last tutorial. I found a few different shades. I've been basically finding this at every, mostly every Dollar Tree location. So this was the shade Mocha. This was Hot Cocoa. So they have a wide variety of shades. This one was Butterscotch. I found tons of Maybelline lip, uh, lip liners and I was super excited because they were nice colors. This is the shade Toast. And I also used this in my last tutorial. They had Raisin and Rose, which are kind of like mauve tone shades. And then this one was just a nude color. So these are great. When I used it the other day, I, I really like the quality. I also found this Lady Speed Stick Full Size Body Wash. And this is the Exotic Blooms Collection. And these super adorable hair clips. I got tons of comments asking about these when I wore them. They are so fun. And I also found these birthday kiss, Hershey Kisses, birthday cake kisses. 